think any basketball player that tells you that they never lost control during the game will definitely be lying. So you'll know when a player doesn't belong in a certain level, especially at the guard position, when he's turning the ball over two seconds. I've seen guys get in the game and they're not comfortable dribbling the basketball. Elite levels can't get the ball across half court because guys are physical, you know, especially in the AAU game, in the high school game, you see guys who are under-equipped. Power Hands Anti-Grip Glove works on ball handling, hand strength, and hand speed all in one. It's anti-grip, so the ball becomes more slippery when trying to dribble it. Now when you add the weights, now you're working on hand strength as well. Since I've been playing the game of basketball, hand strength is immensely important on a lot of levels. I think as you build the strength, that's where hand speed comes into play. When I'm attacking my opponent, if I want to do a move that's right in front of him, obviously hand speed can't be slow. Skill development is extremely important, especially to me, because you know my size and my speed. I was able to get where I wanted on the floor and play against whoever. We train with power hands all the way from fourth grade all the way to the NBA. Uh, it's not like just high school kids use them or NBA guys use them. They really develop, especially at a young age, getting the feel of the ball, developing a quick handle, which is extremely important. Uh, makes you more explosive, especially with the power hands on uh, and the ball wrap. The ball slips out of your hands so when you take it off. Uh, the guys elevate better. They hold onto the ball better. When they catch the ball with one hand, two hands, it sticks to them. You know, the way I describe it is in simple terms is that when you take the gloves off or you take the slick ball wrap off, you just feel incredible with the ball. It's almost like you have this supernatural grip on the basketball. Some of the drills we do, especially with the Power Hands products, is two ball drills. We do a lot of stuff with one ball on the move, combinations, moving the ball, trying to get the ball out of kids' hands. Any player that has uh, a specialty of their game, whether it's an incredible shooter, whether it's an incredible ball handler, whether it's an incredible defender, whatever the case may be, they had to put a lot of time in on that. So for me, I had like great imagination. So I might just be in the half court for three hours imagining that I'm in a game, you know, hitting the game winning shots. And that's kind of how I went about practice a lot. But that's a drill within itself, you know? And if I was younger and I would have the opportunity to have some power hands on during it, it could have only been better. <laughs>